Ow! It's psycho not. And here we are for part 11, I think, of the vanishing of Ethan Carter. Not quite sure where I need to be going. I'm just, uh, I've been wandering around for a little bit. I'm spitballing that I need to maybe go back down by the dam. We'll see. I was thinking that we're running out of areas to go, it seems. And we're also running out of live family members to figure out their, uh, their demises. So I'm guessing I'm nearing the end of the game. Uh, I'm not sure why I had to turn off that hydroelectric generator. I mean, I had to have done something. What was that? Why is it so quiet? Okay, well... Hmm. I don't know. Where do we go? Oh, okay. So this is lower now? Is that what that is? That's the one on? I don't recall being able to cross that entirely. Maybe that's what... What it did. Yeah, I don't think I came over here before. Well, where is this gonna lead me? Ethan was close. I could feel him. A pinprick of light in the darkness. He would know me. He would know why I'd come. Am I gonna see a live person? For the first time? Aside from creepy leper miner man and the ghostly remnants of the pierced. Pierced. Oh, it's gore, guys. Rawr. So gorgeous. Anything on the water's edge? Oh. This is sinister looking. Did Ethan succeed in... in this this place. I don't think I can get in. Oh. Hello. Then fight it. I have to destroy the room. Corvus. I'm sorry, Ethan. I can't let you do that. Oh. Where am I supposed to start the... Okay, I've just got to see where it's going to let me. Core... Oh.
nothing spoopy I am not myself have not been myself voices again today same as yesterday this is most vexum vexum got much to say. I tried to brick her up in the wall, but but she fought me. In the end, I couldn't do it. Not to my wife. Neither she nor the sleepers pleased. Now I must decide whom I fear more. Hmm. What I must do is clear to me now. The sleeper resides in a prison of death, and pain is the key. Mm-hmm. Okay. I hear ya. Okay. Guess I'm gonna touch this guy, even though I don't really... Oh! That's the Grand Powell. Oh, jeez. So... I, re I have no idea how this is gonna go. Let's see. Ethan! I fought it off. It's okay. Grandpa! Get away from me! Your grandmother, Gail, is protecting me from it. Ethan, I can help you. I found Vandergrift's diary. He said for the sleeper to wake up, someone has to suffer. Uh. Look! Oh. When I found that room, I didn't wake him up. He's trying to wake up now. Vandergrift kept his victims alive. He made them suffer. That's what the sleeper wants. We need to get in that room. I can squeeze through. Uh. Oh no. Grandpa! No! What? inside us now. Grandpa! Get back! Oh no. We all have to this die. can't be how it ends. You, you can't just be dead. Even me. Is that... Okay. Better not end abruptly right here. I'll be pretty upset. the door gonna open for me? Mm-hmm. Ethan, wake up. Well, kid, you stopped it. It was horrible, but you stopped it. Paul Prospero? Are you... Are you really here? I'm sorry, Ethan. I was late. Too late. You're right. You were too late. Here. Again. I knew this story. And it was Ethan's as much as it was mine. And it wasn't finished. Not yet. Uh... 
Okay, so this is telling me... where all the things are. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so I actually, oh, I can travel straight here, cool. I actually did do this one. But I had at one point to uh, I messed up a recording and had to just kind of zoom through the first couple little bits. But I had gone back and did them, but I forgot about this one. So let me just let me just do this right quick. Ah, Jesus! And then we can do the last one again.